watching Krim 2 News at 5. Welcome back. Not in our backyard. That is the message from a group of North Idaho neighbors living near proposed asphalt plants. A local company hopes to build that plant at a gravel pit in Sagal, but neighbors are concerned it could affect their health and their property values. Krem 2's Taylor Vido has more now. We want to give you a sense of how close this proposed asphalt plant would be. That's the gravel pit you see behind me there in the distance. And here's how close some homes are as you bear with me as I turn my camera here. Some homes are just a couple hundred yards away and that has neighbors saying that would be way too close for comfort. Who wants to live by a asphalt plant? A question some in Sagal are now asking. This is my backyard. There's where they're going to put it. We didn't plan on it moving next to an asphalt plant. Interstate Concrete has said they want to build an asphalt batch plant on a section of this 135 acre gravel pit not far off of Highway 95 in Sagal. The pit is owned by a private family, neighbors tell me. There are several homes in the area, and neighbors like Bob Stotts worry that an asphalt plant could send off rude odors, sounds, and cause property values to take a hit. Why do we have to put up with worrying about our health? Our water aquifer. At a county meeting earlier this month, Interstate was granted a conditional use permit to allow the plant. This same debate came up a few years ago, but the permit was denied before. Well, I was wondering why. Um, they've already battled this before. John Plant, another neighbor, questions if leaders behind the project are simply trying again because of newly elected planning and zoning officials. I'm really concerned and confused why it went through and actually got voted in through. The neighbors now have a little under a month to file an appeal. If that happens, it'll ultimately be up to Bonner County commissioners to decide. For this story, I did reach out to Interstate Concrete for comment, but I haven't heard back. In Sagal, Taylor Vito, Crem 2 News.